pleasant morning to everyone. 2021 has been a year of both challenges and opportunities for PBCOM. While making plans had initially been difficult, we have taken the right measures, narrowed down variables, and ensured that we take advantage of the reopening of the economy. I am very pleased to share that the plans have proven effective and delivered the optimum results for 2021. But we could not have done this alone. We are grateful to all PBCOM stakeholders, the board, management and employees, customers and partners, regulators, and our shareholders. We all worked as one and fulfilled our corporate promise that together we grew. We are proud to announce PBCOM's exceptional financial performance for year ending December 2021 with a consolidated net income of 1.57 billion pesos, the highest since the entry of the Lushupo Group in 2014. The increase in net income, 34.6% higher versus comparable period in 2020, came on the back of improved performance of its core businesses and normalized provision for granted losses. This translated to a return in equity of 11.78% in 2021, from 9.79% in 2020, while return on assets was at 1.49% from 1.15%. The bank's focus on core businesses such as corporate lending and generation of low-cost deposits has provided the bank a steady income despite market uncertainties. The bank's deposit volume growth was led by a 30% growth in low interest bearing deposit, representing 60.4% of the total deposits. Robust growth in earning assets coupled by low cost funding source improved net interest margin to 4.83%. Total assets reached 100.23 billion pesos in 2021, while capital strengthened to 14.18 billion pesos. PBCOM's Common Equity Tier 1 and Capital Adequacy Ratios were at 15.58% and 18.18% respectively, in excess of the required regulatory ratios. 